briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1978, the United States Court of Appeals for the Sixth Circuit heard a case, United States v. Williams, that focused on the admissibility of written statements as evidence in court. Glenn Williams was charged with cashing forged government checks, and the case revolved around a memorandum detailing a witness's statement about Williams's involvement in the crime. Despite the witness's denial of the statement implicating Williams, the memorandum was admitted as evidence based on the witness's relationship with the defendant, his demeanor, and his selective memory. Williams was found guilty and appealed the decision, arguing that the memorandum should not have been allowed as evidence. The case hinged on whether Williams had knowledge of the forgeries and intended to defraud the United States. The appeals court ultimately upheld the district court's decision to admit the memorandum, finding no reversible error, but declined to address whether the statement could be admitted as non-hearsay evidence, leaving this question for future cases where its resolution is necessary. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 